54 years ago, OSAF, the organization to promote South American thoroughbreds, was founded. Its objective was, and still is, to link, to join the South American countries where horse racing is an activity involving thousands of people and whose ultimate purpose, the magnificent show afforded by horse racing, spells prime entertainment for countless thoroughbred racing fans and followers. OSAF is formed by various jockey clubs, race courses, stud books, equestrian institutions, and the leading breeders and owners associations in Latin America. OSAF encompasses members from Argentina, Brazil, Chile, Colombia, Ecuador, Mexico, Panama, Paraguay, Peru, Uruguay, and Venezuela. OSAF now seeks a closer relationship with international organizations and race courses the world over. Today, these events face a more demanding public, gradually turning race courses into entertainment centers, which not only open their doors to welcome the public, now they reach out for audiences through other means. A new interconnection has been born for the whole region to truly enjoy a great horse racing day, no matter their location. To this end, and without surrendering its founding principles, OSAF is currently set to cater for the needs of global horse racing, fine-tuning its structures and its rules, aiming at packed grandstands for those grand horse racing days, sharing them with worldwide audiences. On the course, the best horses enliven the great races, and vibrant images reach out to the whole equestrian world through all the currently available formats. Our horses, bred with European and American genetic contributions, have won races worldwide. From Silen, a British thoroughbred who arrived at the turn of the 20th century, up to Giant Causeway, a Kentucky bred, first in the United States breeders' ranking for two consecutive years and for two seasons in Argentina. Spend the Buck and Shiroko were imported in Brazil, and Fuisachi Pegasus and Scat Daddy in Chile. The foals they sired with locally selected brood mares, as well as with young imported mares, demand high-level race courses and top seed professionals. The investment in breeding carries on. In 2011, more than 17,000 births were registered in the area spelling more than a 15% contribution to the world production of thoroughbred horses. Furthermore, during that season, 28,000 horses run in our racetracks, an average of 10 per race, and almost 2,000 stallions have serviced more than 27,000 broodmares in OSAF countries. OSAF jockeys, trainers and veterinarians work in several countries. Scientists not only go for training, as they themselves also make their contributions. Argentine trainers Horacio Luro and Angel Pena both made a name for themselves in the United States and in Europe. Likewise, South American jockeys are well known in the United States. The Venezuelans Ramon Dominguez and Javier Castellano, Panamanian Alex Solis, Mexican Mario Gutierrez, Peruvians Jorge Chavez, Edgar Prado, Chileans Fernando Toro and Jose Santos, among others. And it is in our region, Argentina, where the Brazilian Jorge Ricardo, who clocks more than 11,700 victories, won yet again, established a world record of won races competing against the Canadian Russell Bays, who runs in California. In the last three years, horses exported from our countries registered more than 1,000 victories, 
some in the most important equestrian centers. The great shows, those with numerous group races, such as Ascot, the Breeders' Cup, the Prix de l'Arc de Triomphe, the Japan Cup, the Dubai World Cup, the Hong Kong Cup and the Melbourne Cup all are commonplace for OSAF countries. The show is far-reaching and the regional racers reach worldwide audiences who bet in them and thoroughly enjoy them. The grand racers like the Gran Premio Carlos Pellegrini in San Isidro and the Gran Premio Nacional in Palermo, both of them run in Argentina, the Gran Premio Brazil in Gavia, the José Pedro Ramírez in Maronias, Uruguay, the Gran Premio Hipódromo de Chile, the Derby de Viña and the Ensayo at the Club Hípico of Chile and at the Jockey Club in Monterrico, Lima, the Handicap de las Américas in Mexico and the Gran Clásico Presidente de la República in Panama, all of them constitute part of a tradition which has welcomed new events such as the Breeders' Cup, the Carreras de las Estrellas in Argentina, the Copa de Criadores y Propietarios in Brazil and the Serie de Campeones in Uruguay. To this list, we are the Gran Premio Asociación Latinoamericana de Jockey Clubs e Hipódromos, an event which alternates its venue among different South American racecourses, but whose organization and implementation facilitates the meeting of the leaders of the whole continent. This new global and harmonizing outlook calls upon leading institutions such as the OSAF to actively participate, leading the way, outlining the current trends. Medication and ratings are the mainstays of this day in, day out task, and so it is that OSAF keeps on organizing and sponsoring congresses and conferences in which experts from the most important equestrian countries take part. Their contribution is central for the exchange of ideas and experiences taking place in laboratories and amongst the racetrack handicappers. Aware of its role, OSAF prepares reports, statistics and papers like the ones we shall see these days. But even more so, OSAF has become a trustworthy and essential circle for the joint work that these times demand.